Hello, and welcome to the Kansas State Veterinary Diagnostic Lab YouTube channel. This video will discuss heat treatment of serum for heartworm testing. The American Heartworm Society recommends a yearly antigen and microfilarial test for all dogs before prescribing a heartworm preventative. In dogs with clinical signs consistent with heartworm disease but negative on heartworm antigen tests, the heat reversal test can be a useful diagnostic tool before proceeding to a more costly or invasive test for heart disease. Antigen blocking occurs when the dog develops antibodies to circulating heartworm antigen and prevents the diagnostic test from detecting it, resulting in a false negative. This phenomenon has been documented on all heartworm diagnostic platforms, so switching tests will not change the outcome. It has been estimated that the incidence in shelter dogs may be as high as 10% in endemic areas. The percent of owned dogs who falsely test positive is much lower and often have a history of no or infrequent heartworm preventative use. Heat treatment destroys these antibodies, allowing the test to accurately detect the presence of heartworms. Remember, heat-treated serum cannot be used for other antibody tests such as tick-borne diseases, as those antibodies will be destroyed in the heat process as well. While this procedure could be run in clinic, to be run properly, this test requires a heating unit to take the serum to 104 degrees C and a centrifuge capable of reaching speeds of 15,000 times gravity. Most veterinarians find that this test is not cost efficient for a clinic due to the high cost of instrumentation and the low incidence of testing needed for well-kept animals. Therefore, many diagnostic labs now offer this test as a tool to help veterinarians work up animals with clinical signs consistent with heartworm disease. The Kansas State Diagnostic Lab now offers this test and a minimum sample of 0.5 ml of serum is required. For more information, contact Client Care.